Bethany C. Morrow's novel, A Song Below Water, is a powerful commentary on race, identity, and belonging. The story follows two young women, Tavia and Effie, who live in a world where magical beings called sirens are feared and hunted. Tavia is a siren, but she keeps her abilities hidden from the world for fear of persecution. Effie, on the other hand, is a normal human but is struggling to find her place in the world. Through their journeys, the novel explores important themes of racism, sexism, and the power of community. One of the main themes in the novel is the power of identity. Tavia, as a siren, faces discrimination and persecution from society. She feels the need to hide her true self, and this causes her to struggle with her sense of identity. This is highlighted in a scene where Tavia and Effie attend a protest against police brutality, and Tavia feels torn between wanting to participate and feeling like she doesn't belong. This struggle with identity is a powerful metaphor for the experiences of marginalized communities, who often feel pressure to assimilate and hide their true selves in order to fit in with society. Another important theme in the novel is the role of community. Throughout the story, Tavia and Effie are supported by a diverse group of people who come together to help them. This includes Tavia's mother, her siren mentor, and a group of activists who work to protect magical beings. The power of community is especially evident in the novel's climax, where Tavia and Effie are able to defeat their enemies with the help of their friends. This theme is a reminder of the importance of building strong connections with others and working together to fight against oppression. The novel also explores the intersection of race and gender. Tavia, as a black siren, faces discrimination not only because of her magical abilities but also because of her race. Her experiences highlight the ways in which racism and sexism intersect to create unique challenges for black women. This is especially evident in a scene where Tavia is accused of being a dangerous black girl by a police officer. The novel's exploration of these issues is a reminder of the need to fight against all forms of discrimination and oppression. In addition to its powerful themes, the novel is also notable for its strong characterization. Tavia and Effie are both complex, well-developed characters who grow and change throughout the story. Tavia, in particular, is a compelling protagonist, and her struggles with her identity and her relationships with her mother and her siren mentor are some of the most interesting parts of the novel. The novel's writing style is also noteworthy. Moro's prose is lyrical and evocative, and she uses a variety of storytelling techniques, including first-person narration and transcripts of interviews and radio shows, to create a rich and immersive world. The novel's use of mythology and folklore also adds depth and complexity to the story. One potential weakness of the novel is its pacing. At times, the story moves slowly, and some readers may find themselves struggling to stay engaged. Additionally, the novel's focus on social issues may not appeal to readers who are looking for a more action-packed or escapist story. Overall, A Song Below Water is a powerful and thought-provoking novel that explores important themes of race, identity, and community. Moro's writing is beautiful and immersive, and her characters are complex and well-developed. While the novel may not be for everyone, 
it is a valuable addition to the conversation around social justice and representation in young adult literature.